Well, we decided that a film could reach so many more people yeah. and it's accessible to everyone. Like, the amount of people who've seen it is yeah. phenomenal. Yeah, I think as well, like you said, um, because then other people can take it and pass it on. So it's not just the people that can come and see us. Um, it can be, oh, okay, oh, that was amazing. I'll take it, I'll show all my colleagues and then they'll show all their colleagues. So the message of like, that we wanted to portray with the film is really getting out there and it's spreading. With it being a film that gave us the chance to say everything that we wanted to say, um, like in one go, so everyone could understand. I feel like being open about our struggles also helped us. It helped us to grow closer as friends and it helped us to feel better about ourselves. We definitely became closer like as friends and it was just really fun to sort of make a film yeah. and be part of something. Yeah. Um, so I think for us it started off with just a lot of brainstorming sessions like basically sitting around just um, having lots of ideas and kind of trying to figure out what was the most plausible. I felt like every week we'd come together and we'd all have these amazing ideas but actually they'd probably take about seven years to make so actually kind of had to narrow it down to something quite simple but at the same time quite effective. Um, I think um, for us it was a lot about like trying to keep it as natural as possible so although we'd read the questions we would like we kind of decided that none of us should prepare answers because otherwise it just feels really rehearsed and it feels really uncomfortable we just kind of tried to tell the truth as much as possible i think yeah the interview process was odd because some of us had never done anything like that before and i mean it was a lot of sort of umming and ahhing and yeah. trying to figure out what to say <laughs> yeah which was interesting I felt quite nervous about having a camera so close to my face when I've never done something like this before. It was also a fun new experience. I think by by sort of creating our answers on the spot, it it really portrays what we what we really feel because nobody's prepared anything. We're just speaking from inside our own heads. And being able to do what we enjoy um, at the end was a nice way to show that. Rather than just talking about what we do to relax, we got to show people what we care about as well. I think as well, we all learnt new things about each other. Like, we all saw new aspects of each other. So like, we saw you dance, we saw my dog, we saw <laughs> Justina's drawings. We all got to like learn new things about each other as well. I think it was just nice to sort of do something together. Yeah, definitely. I think it, it's been probably 100% positive. Yeah. But I think quite a lot of people are surprised that a group of young people can produce something that is high quality and informative yeah. but without being really boring. Mm. I think as well like for a lot of people similar to like what you said they were just really shocked because I think because we were so like so open and so honest and we just put it all out there for everyone to see it was like oh my goodness like when we showed it the first time in front of so many people there were so many people coming up going oh my gosh you guys are so brave I don't know if you, I could do what you do. And um, so yeah, it's been really, really positive. And the fact that so many people have come up afterwards saying, oh, I want to show this to my work colleagues or people I work with is really nice because it means that they're not just kind of saying it to be nice. They actually want to use it for the reason that we made it. So it feels like a very successful, like good feeling. Yeah, my school used it as part of staff training. And I've had lots of teachers who I didn't really talk too much come up to me and say that they didn't realise what I'd been through and that all of us did a great job making the film and that it was like, it looked great and everything. And it's just nice to have that connection and that people, it shows that it's making a difference that we wanted it to make. See, I've also like only ever experienced positive reactions from it. I think I was actually shopping one day and someone who'd seen the, the film at the conference and us like talking came up to me and was like, wow. And she was talking about how like she would never have done it and that she was really, really inspired. And I thought that was really amazing. Mm -hmm. I feel like, sorry. I feel like it's really great that most people see it. Uh, people that actually knew us before the film, which makes me a bit less nervous about them seeing it as well. Because for example, I wouldn't be able to show it to most of my family since they don't speak English. and. I think showing it to people who don't really know anything about me is just easier in a way. I was quite surprised by just how many people had seen it because I was on the train a couple of weeks ago and somebody I'd never seen before, I knew nothing about, they approached me and said, you know, I, I saw your video online and I, I was really impressed by what you and your peers uh, have accomplished. 
and then I, I started thinking about it like yeah we've actually done something really important I think I speak for all of us when I say that we just want people to realize that having a mental health issue isn't isn't really that strange it happens to a lot of people it's not something to be ashamed of I think this project has helped us convey to to people everywhere that just go and get the help you need. Yeah, it's not something you should be embarrassed about, like, and it's not something that takes up your whole personality because although sometimes it can feel like it takes up every single part of you, um, but I think meeting people and talking to people who have had similar experiences to you, um, or even kind of know like a in, like a little tiny bit of what you're going through just makes you think like oh my goodness i'm not just this crazy person i'm also all these other parts of my personality that are really important so i think as well yeah it just brought out the fact that we're all kind of whole people and this is just a little part of ourselves i just hope if some young person sees it then like they know that they're not the only people like struggling with things because i think if i'd have seen it it would have been easier to open up to my friends and just people like that about things like this yeah i think definitely hearing other people's stories when you're at a low point and hearing someone talk about them and they've been through it, it gives you hope for the future and if that can happen with someone's story then that's, even if it's just one person, that's a difference that we've made. I think one thing that we tried quite hard to convey is that Gracie said to see our mental health issues don't define us but they are, they are a part of us and we're not ashamed of that so our experiences have made us who we are and that is a good thing under everything it is a good thing it was really interesting and exciting to see the film develop as well from just our ideas to be like filming it and then it making the final product into something that we're all really proud of and been, it's been great to be a part of i mean 100 percent would love to do it again it was fun yeah. and i mean we did some good while having fun we would recommend it to other people as well because I think this sort of experience is really helpful for people who actually participate in it as well. 10 out of 10 would recommend. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 10 out of 10 would do it again. <laughs>